coming up in all angles. The race is heating up. Peter P and Peter B. Lines drawn. So when a man say, what is Peter Phillips' role? Peter Phillips' role is different from my role. Because Peter Phillips is now the goalkeeper. And me and Andre and Embings and Fars, we are the forward. What's the responsibility of a goalkeeper? The goalkeeper is to make sure we don't lose. The forward is to go and make sure we win. Declarations made. I hear my vice president tell me, say, footballer play. And he my striker and Dr. Phillips are the keeper. Well, when we go down to South East St. Mary, we get one. We go over Portland and we get two. And if we are not two love, the courts are going to make a change. I could have the eight, eight money, minutes money, money, money. Yeah, yeah. But who's ahead? in studio this evening to talk about the PNP leadership challenge. We have with us public affairs commentators Javian Nelson, Nadine Spence, Paul Ashley, as well as Clyde Williams. Now, as always, welcome to you and welcome to our viewers on OneSpotMedia.com. Just before we get into discussion, well, everybody's been talking up a storm. Let's hear a little bit of what Peter Phillips said at his recent launch of his campaign. And them say, nothing not go on. And them say, we now promote young people. Then I ask, what is Andre Harton? Who is Andre Harton? Who is Damian Crawford? Who is Crystal Tomlinson? Make I tell you, my mission is to bring the youth, push them forward, and let them take control of the future in the People's National Party and in our country. Don't forget. One day I lead a press conference calling for the government to level about what happened in the Ministry of Education. The next day, wholeness fire. Royal Reed and them said the PNP now do nothing. What kind of badness? Let me tell you. What you have is some people who have been determined whatever happened to carry a negative and defeatist message about the People's National Party. If you want to see the team do better, there is space for everyone to work. Every single one. That is how we have built this party. Okay, so first question. Is the challenge a good thing for the People's National Party or not, Javier Nelson? Yeah, absolutely. I think the challenge is a particularly good one. I mean, already we see the PNP seeming renewed. Everywhere you go, people talking about the PNP, when you hear comrades talk online, offline, etc. Even people who are not comrades. I have one friend who um, is very, very much a labor right, and she talks about how everywhere she goes, everybody's talking about how excited they are about the challenge, and in particular, Peter Bunting's challenge to the current mm -hmm. party leader. Maybe. Yes, it is a good thing. I think at the time when the challenge came up as well, it was right in the middle of Mr. Siaga's, um, the observation <laughs> of Mr. Siaga's passing. And much of the conversation had been about what he had done or didn't do and so on. And it, so it was very JLP focused. Having um, established the challenge, it shifted the conversation. So I think it was a very good thing. Uh, Dr. Phillips needs this challenge more than Bunting does. Machiavelli, the prince, he who obtains sovereignty by the assistance of the nobles maintains himself with more difficulty than he who comes to it by the aid of the people. Because the former finds himself with many around him who consider themselves his equals. And because of this, he can neither rule nor manage them to his liking. But he who reaches sovereignty by the popular favor finds himself alone and has none around him or few who are not prepared to obey him. He should take a leaf from Mr. Patterson's book. It's the best thing for him. He needs legitimacy. The delegates of the PMP have never endorsed him. 2006 he lost. 2008 he lost. He's been preparing himself for more than 13 years for the position of leader of the party. 